Yeah, girl. I'm still working remotely. And then you know that HR had a nerve enough to call me and tell me I'm going live too much on company time. Yeah, they said I was addicted to social media. Then they suggested that I try a program called Socialist. They must be crazy. Ain't nobody addicted to nothing. Wait a minute, hold on, girl. Ooh. When you want. Wait a minute, when he posts, he was single. Mm hmm. I'm gonna have to swipe on right on him, girl. I shouldn't have been drinking them green tea lattes. That's what I get for going to the bathroom. I missed it. No, I tried the app. The No Contact Love app. I didn't get no matches, girl. I know. Hold on one minute. I guess I'm back to sliding in the DMs. I'll call you back later, girl. No. Millions of people struggle with social media addiction. Are you one of them? It's time to make a change. You need to be social less. I need to be social less. I need to be social less. Hey, hey, hey. It is an unstoppable day. Welcome, everyone. I want to thank you for joining our social less group today. Now, for those of you who are new to the group, we assist people who are struggling with social media addiction. Now, normally I'd like to meet with you in person, but because of this pandemic that we're going through right now, we will be meeting virtually until further notice. Now, I'm looking around and I see a couple of new faces in the group. Who'd like to go first and share? Wait, what? I thought this was my online history class. Ma, you signed me into the wrong room. It's a bunch of weird people on here. I'd like to share. My wife and I got into this argument the other day because she says that I am on social media too much. I tried to explain to her that I need to be there in case of emergency. You see, my blood type is rare. I'm type O. What if someone sent you to a blood transfusion and they put out a post looking for my blood type? I need to make sure I'm available. I could save someone's life. And I don't understand why my wife doesn't get that. So what if I happen to like a few photos of women while looking for emergency posts? What's wrong with that? Hey guys, it is so great to hear from you. Hi Tana. Hi Greg. You all, you would not believe what I'm doing right now. My dad had the nerve to sign me up for this social media addict group thing or whatever. Like that is so unnecessary. Excuse me, Shannon. Are you actually going live right now? Yes, she is. I'm actually following her right now. Can't believe Shannon's so great. Oh, and she just liked my comment. Oh, that's so cool. Oh my gosh, Shannon, is that you? Oh, I follow you, girl. Look at my earrings. I'm wearing them because you told me to wear them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Everyone, turn off your social media right now. Keep it together, Ken. Keep it together. Remember what you learned in your anger management class, man. <clears throat> okay. Who wants to go next? I'll go next. Hello, my name is Olivia. And I'm really not addicted to social media. I only follow one person, really. My ex-boyfriend, that's it. I mean, I used to follow him as me. But then he blocked me. Just because I made a few comments on a few of his posts about his new girlfriend. I mean, it was just constructive criticism. So, I created a few other profiles just so I could... Still keep up with them. 
It's not like I'm stalking him or anything. It's just been really hard and, well, I miss him. Hi, my name is Dana and I'm a socialholic. You know it's bad when you have to take your phone to the bathroom with you. I think I have arthritis in my hand from too much trolling. I mean scrolling. One time, I told my brother to see what he was up to, and he was in the kitchen. Oh man, I spent so many hours liking and sharing posts. I was sharing posts about people who were supposedly dead. That wasn't even true. One time it was a post about me, and I shared it before I realized they were talking about me. <laughs> I'm not dead. I need help. I need help. Hi, I'm Simone. The only reason I'm on here is because my job required me to do so. I'll see y'all later. Well, my name is Deacon Derek, and I got a problem. They say I'm always taking pictures, and I'm always on social media. Well, today, I was supposed to be recording the preacher. 30 to 40 minutes. All I got on film was me hollering, preach, preacher, go ahead, preacher, tell it, preacher, but wasn't no preacher. Now the Lord delivered Daniel from the line B. He delivered my wife from a running spirit. Surely he can deliver me too. That's all I got to say. I need help. Thank you everyone for sharing. You did an unstoppable job. Now I believe that each and every one of you has the ability to overcome the need for being connected. I simply just want you now to take the social less pledge. Now repeat after me and say, I will social less. 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 Um, I will not be doing that. Sorry, not sorry, but my audience kind of needs me. But as a matter of fact, you guys can actually join my live. So I'm going to be doing a live later and I'm going to be talking about my experience here in this meeting today. So yeah, see you soon. Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. I need to turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. I need to be social less. I need to be social less. I'm addicted to liking, to loving, to sharing is wearing me out. Social less. I need to be social less. I keep checking my DMs from AM to PM. It's got to stop. Social less. I need to be social less. Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. I need to turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. I need to turn it off, turn it off, turn it off